Good morning, everyone. Today is maintenance day for the country clipper. And as you can see, it's filthy, covered in grass. I've uh, cut that pasture out back at least twice, I think, with it now, and I haven't sharpened the blades yet. So I've been meaning to do it, I just haven't got around to it. So today we're gonna clean the deck out, sharpen the blades, give it a bath, get it all set to go for, you know, another couple of weeks, see what it takes. Um, I'm gonna get you guys set up and I'll show you kind of follow along what I'm doing. But the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna flip this thing right up so the deck's exposed, um, which just is the easiest way to clean it out and, sharp, and get the blades off, sharpen the blades. It is one of the things I love about the Country Clipper is being able to get easy access to the deck. So like I said, I'll set you up and I'll show you how that goes. So the first thing we wanna do is get our deck down as low as we can. Get it down as low as we can. Don't want to block your view. And then pin it to the there. Pin it down to the lowest setting. So it keeps it down as low as it goes. And Lovely little handle here releases the tension on the pulley. With that tension released, pull the belt off. And then you just flip up the deck. Just like that. And there you go. Easy access under the deck and yeah, it's dirty. Easy access to the blades. And that guy just sits, sits up on its own. The brake is on and the weight of the lawnmower holds itself up. So again, absolutely love this. <coughs> Excuse me. About the Country Clipper. And it's, it's, it's not too, too heavy. I mean, a little heavy, but it's not horrible at all to lift that up, so. Now that that's up, we'll get that blades off and get it cleaned out. All right, got my scraper for cleaning, got the drill, start with getting the blades off. Yeah, those blades need some work. Now the fun part, the gross part. Not perfect. Definitely a heck of a lot better. I was debating what I was gonna do, but I think I'm gonna take the pressure washer to it really quick too, and just to really clean it out.
not 100%, but I put the bolts back in, just keep water out of the out of the holes themselves. I don't want anything to rust, make sure it doesn't get too wet. At least I figure this will help without a clean up as well. Whoops. Sorry, a little bit of background noise, Candace is just coming up with the side by side. That's just my little pressure washer, it's not doing too much. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna put some soap in there and see if that helps. the greatest but it works you can tell uh, which spindles get used the most the discharge in the middle one saw that was pretty clean and it came up even better definitely tell where the wear is where the grass sits oh well that's clean sharpen the blades time so I am no expert in this but I do what I can and it seems to help so run you through one doing a balancing, something simple. Just gotta get it to stop moving around. I don't know, keep it wiggling. It's actually not bad if it's sitting like that. I'd say that's, that's pretty good. Doesn't look horrible either. We'll use that one we'll just get the rest of them done here there we go all sharpened up i did notice one of them probably the discharge one it's getting a little wore up these are original blades still so i'm going to move it to the far side to the the trim side because it's i mean obviously so it took the less the least amount of grass buildup damage whatever you want to call it So these guys were washer on one side, spacer on the other. I 
just hand hand do them first, hand feed them, and then take the drill. this thing down it's basically just the reverse up and kind of kick the bottom out Anybody wondering how hard or how well it stays up on its own? You saw I had to kick that deck out pretty good, so it stays up pretty pretty good on its own. Of course now it's wet over here. Hope we got you in the right spot. There you go, belt back on. And pull the tensioner. There you go. Deck is back on. I'm just gonna bring it back to normal height. And uh, grease. Maybe wash first and then grease. I think that looks pretty good. I sure as heck not going to complain about it. It's definitely a lot cleaner than it was. Give you a look. Nice and clean, nice and red again. Not plastered and grass. Mind you, I'm going to let it sit here and dry before I drive it down there. I'm going to do some greasing as well that I was just couldn't remember. So I was just looking and I don't see grease on the front spindle so i thinking it's just the front tires that i need to grease I'm trying to look under that far one nope they're all just bolted i think it's the new ones that are greaseless i can't remember the name they're all sealed i do remember them talking about that when i got it so grease up the front tires and uh, we'll let it dry so the proof that i'm behind i still have the needle on the greaser instead of my lock and lube um that's still offset up from the winter time. So I haven't even switched it out yet. So I gotta get that it switched out really quick and then we'll get this thing greased up. <laughs> Nothing too exciting to see in there, a little shady. Oh, quality control inspector's coming over. There it goes. 
Perfect. Starting to come out. Move on to the next one. No sponsorship here, guys, or anything, but that lock and lube. I love it. It works really well. It just holds on and easy to get on and off. Coming out the top. That one's good. Apparently had some in there already. Too easy. That one was not bad at all. Uh, last one. Where did it go? Oh yes, there it is. Inside the tire. Sorry, the inside of the tire. I don't know how to say that. There we go. Coming out. What I like to see. So there we go. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me about that. Simple, quick and done. Lawnmower's washed up. The blades are changed. The deck was cleaned out. L lubed the front wheels. It's the only ones I can remember that need lubing. These uh, spindles apparently don't. I do remember something about that when I bought it too. So it makes sense that I can't find any. But yeah, nothing crazy. Sorry, just wait for a truck to go by. Nothing crazy, but got to do the maintenance on these things. You saw how bad that deck was. So got to do your maintenance, stay up on it. Otherwise, that's it for today. So hope you guys enjoyed. Take care. Till next time, see you guys and girls.